people have to have some type of motivation to learn, either a desire to learn or a compelling need to learn. For example, you cannot perform your job unless you learn how to do it. <clears throat> if you cannot do your job, you'll get fired. For maximum learning effect, practice needs to be contextual, mirroring the situation where learning will be applied as closely as possible. For example, if you want a person to learn to drive, you put them in the car on the road, not in a classroom with a written test. Feedback reinforces that you're doing well and it helps you out and tells you what you need to work on when you're performing poorly. Most of us like to win at things even though some of us might say we don't like competition. Games don't necessarily have to be a competition. Games can be cooperative or competitive. Cooperation can still lead to a win state in a game if you beat the game or achieve the game goal. Lots of people enjoy the opportunity to work with others. Think of times you've played a game as a team and the enjoyment you got out of working together as a team toward the game goal. How many of you loved to explore and play in new places as a kid? It's exploring new places and things that make learning enjoyable. Crossword puzzles, word searches, and strategy games are popular because people like to solve problems and they like to formulate strategies. Getting to be someone or something you're not in the real world is fun for many people. It's also a safe way to try new behaviors. Lots of us enjoy the element of surprise or the unexpected. Often the biggest fun is initiating the surprise, not receiving the surprise. Encourage game-based learning! learning.